Hey everyone. Okay, somebody's asked me to do a vlog on whether it gets any easier. So I've been on the lean train now for just over 12 months. And let's start at the beginning. At the beginning, it's like climbing a mountain. Um, it was very, very different in terms of nutrition. I had a complete sugar come down. I used to drink alcohol and I stopped drinking alcohol and there was the cravings for that in situations like dinner, out with clients or Saturday night at home with the curry. Um, takeaways, another great example, Friday night, Saturday night takeaways, they stopped. So there's lots of adjustment, there's lots of pushing yourself through the change curve. There's lots of throwing toys out of the pram because it's a different lifestyle and it's something that is something that you need to create new habits around. So it was tough, it was hard. And I seem to go through that for each new cycle of the body coach because if you've done the body coach, you'll know that every 30 days, the whole thing changes and you kind of go through this once more. On top of that is the difficulty around the exercise. So I have to be honest, at the start, I used a personal trainer because if I wouldn't have used a personal trainer, I don't think I would have got out there and done it because I didn't enjoy it. You know, I used to be big, I couldn't do a mountain climber, my tummy got in the way, it used to slap onto my legs when I jumped in the, in the air. I'd get red in the face, hot, out of breath. I hated the way I sounded when I was out of breath. It was a whole host of things that was constantly pushing against and, and trying to get me to stop. So that was hard and it took digging deep and lots of positive thinking in order to get through. And then of course what happens is you start to get results and the results start to drive you forward and therefore you can see the reward and the hard work and the effort is therefore worth it. And then comes a tipping point, which was probably October time for me, where the results start to really slow down. And every month it's, you know, half a kilo lost or half an inch lost or, you know, it's much smaller, much slower, much more gradual. And therefore you need to look for other wins to keep you motivated, to keep you driving forward and to keep you on it. And and that's what I did, you know, is push myself with the exercise, look for personal best, look for different types of clothing that I hadn't worn before, um, celebrated all the little things, all the little non-scale victories or wins that happened and, and really tried to emphasise those in my mind. And then I go on another journey of macro tracking, which again is something completely different and you have to go through the change curve and get used to it. So I guess 12 months is a long time to be living in a different lifestyle and habitually it gets easier because it's just your way of working and you know it's, it's straightforward and you know what to expect and you know what you need to do. Mentally, it's not as easy um, as you would think it would be 12 months down the line. And I think, you know, if I was to sum up the does it get easier question in a really succinct answer, it would be it isn't easier, it's just a different challenge. And I think at the crux of it, success comes from being mentally strong and from thinking positively because I know that unless I practice my daily affirmations, unless I make my inner voice talk to me like it would speak to other people constantly and consistently, unless I believe that I look beautiful and that my body is amazing, I won't feel those things. And that's when self-doubt creeps in and that's when the chocolate starts going in or the pizza or all of the bad things because then you don't feel worthy and you're not putting the right things into your body because you don't matter to yourself anymore. So for me, it doesn't get easier. You have to keep practicing the mental and positive thinking. Otherwise, 
it's very easy to fall off the wagon. And I think my success has come because I have consistently applied positive thinking all the way through. So it's not easier, it's, more, it's just a challenge and I love a challenge and I keep stepping up to the mark and overcoming every single one. And so can you, so keep going.